IGRA test results. There are four types of results for the IGRA test. Positive, negative, borderline, and indeterminate. Let's take a look at what these mean. If the result is positive, the doctor will explain the results. A positive result means that there is a possibility you have been infected with tuberculosis. The general flow for a positive test result is as follows. First, tuberculosis onset status will be confirmed by a chest X-ray photograph. The public health center will write a letter of introduction for you to see a medical institution. We will give you the letter of introduction and the chest X-ray photograph. Make sure to visit a medical institution, respiratory medicine, etc., with these in hand. For more details, please refer to 27 latent tuberculosis infection and 28 treatment of latent tuberculosis infection. If you have a history of treatment for tuberculosis but are not undergoing medicinal treatment, a chest X-ray will be performed every six months for a two-year span. Next, we will discuss the negative result. If the result is negative, there is little chance that you have tuberculosis. This test will mark the end of your exam. However, depending on the overall infection situation of exposed persons as a whole, you may have to continue having chest X-ray exams and blood samples. In this case, please be sure to see a doctor. We will now discuss the borderline result. A borderline result means your immune status has declined and the correct response did not occur. The results will be determined from the test results as a whole the exposure situation, etc. The indeterminate result may mean your immune system is deficient and does not respond correctly. There are a variety of factors that can cause an indeterminate result. In this event, re-examination may be performed. Finally, if you have symptoms such as a cough persisting for more than two weeks, please visit a medical institution, such as respiratory medicine, as soon as possible.